Hey guys, what's happening? My name is Sergey. In this video, I want to talk about a subject that is really sensitive. I've been watching some YouTube videos on stuttering and I've come across a few coaches, a few so-called professionals that promise you some miraculous results. Uh, they promise you that you can get instantaneous results in just three days. So this is something that I want to cover in this video, something that I want to talk about and something that I want to share my ideas on. So here I go. So what kind of people look for help when it comes to stuttering? Well, all kinds of people stutter. You might be a university student or a high school student or a college student, or you might be a grown up man with a proper job and a family and you still stutter. I know some people that stutter, but I don't know a lot of people who look for professional help to deal with this uh, little problem. So a lot of people stutter. And one thing that's common for all these people, as far as I'm concerned, is that um, somebody who stutters has been doing this for a a significant period of their life. It's not just one or two years. It's like most likely 10 or 15 years that they stutter. Uh, so that's number one. People stutter. People who stutter, they have been stuttering for a long time. Another thing that's happening is that all these people obviously go through a crazy amount of suffering in their daily life. I mean, those things that are simple for a regular person, you know, um, going to a store and asking for help, talking to a stranger, um, talking to uh, somebody on the phone, you know, doing a public presentation for all the normal people, that's no biggie. But for somebody who stutters, I mean, that is hell. And you wake up with this idea every single day that you will stutter and you go to bed with the same idea that, you know, nothing is changing in your, your life is kind of miserable. So for somebody who's younger, who goes to high school, a lot of people say that, you know, they get mocked on and they get laughed at. And that is normal because, you know, uh, children are cruel and, you know, they do whatever they want to do. Uh, when you grow up, when you be become an adult, uh, that, that's not the case no more. People don't laugh at, you, at laugh at you, people don't point fingers at you, but you still live with it and you still know that they know that you stutter. And your life is not really that much more comfortable. You continue to stutter. So I just want to go back to what I was saying before. I came across, I came across a lot of these so-called professionals that uh, will help you to get rid of your stuttering in just three days. I mean, can you imagine three days? So the first question that I'm asking myself is why the hell is it three days? Why is it not five days or six days or nine days or 33 days? Why is this specific number? Well, I mean, you be the judge, but I think it just sounds nice. You know, it sounds like, it doesn't sound like it's one day, you know, because one day, that's not realistic. And it doesn't sound like 33 days, you know, because that's too long. So three days is this nice number that really attracts us. You know, it feels like you're gonna put some effort in and it doesn't feel too long. So it feels all right. Three days feels kind of reasonable. So. I think that a lot of people on this planet, you know, were drawn to something that uh, can be easily achieved, that is uh, easy to attain, that is simple and fast and quick. I mean, there is a whole multi-billion industry uh, based on this specific uh, human psyche. I mean, how many times have you heard uh, that some author is telling you in just three simple steps or in just... Uh, you know, 10 simple steps. I will teach you how, and you can continue. You can lose weight. You can become a millionaire. You, you will, you will learn how to communicate with other people. You will become more confident. You will get women. You will lose weight. You will start your business. I mean, the list goes on. I mean, so much money has been made of this specific, um, scheme, you know? So three days, I mean, you should be the judge. Is this realistic to get off, to get rid of something that has been a big part of your life. As I was saying before, people who stutter, they, they, they haven't just started for like, you know, a year or two or a month. I mean, it has been going on for a long time, mostly 10 or 15 years. So, I mean, you be the judge. Is it possible to get rid of something, of something in just three days, in just three simple steps? Oh, and by the way, did I forget to mention how much the uh, price for those courses is? It's 8,000 bucks just for three days. Guys, don't get me wrong. I'm not trying to bash anybody's business. I mean, you know, people make money off it, of these three-day programs, of these, you know, 10-step programs. 
And uh, I mean, you can go online yourself and read some of the comments. A lot of the, a lot of the comments are negative. A lot of people are not happy with the results that they got. People comment that uh, they were able, they were, they were getting some results in those three days, but after they were out of the classroom, everything started happening again. They started to stutter. What realistically can you get out of those three days? Well, you can get inspired. You better get inspired for 8,000 bucks. I mean, that's for sure. Your guide, your coach, your trainer, he or she can put you on that path. Uh, and whether you will follow the path, I mean, it's up to you. I mean, that's number two. Uh, also, you definitely will, will feel more comfortable talking to your coach. Uh, in those three days, you will get used to the person. You will more or less uh, trust that person because, I mean, you're talking about something that is, um, you know, very intimate. Uh, so you trust that person and your speech normalizes in just those three days. You might read something out loud and you will not stutter. You might even record yourself on camera and you will not stutter. I mean, how amazing that is. But what happens after those three days? After those three days, you, you're out of the classroom and you're back to square one where you started. You're in the real world with real people and you don't have that comfortable environment that you were in during those three days. So you're back to square one, 8,000 bucks short, and you feel frustrated. So can you get rid of your stuttering in just three simple days for 8,000 bucks? Obviously, I don't think so. And the reason for that is because you have been living with stuttering for a long time. If you have been doing something wrong for a long time, first of all, it will take some time to kick that old bad habit out of you and then you have to acquire some new habits, some new skills, and some new techniques. You will have to rethink and relearn how you think. You have to uh, pay more attention to th uh, the way you think and the way you, uh, the way you say something. You have to pay attention to your body language and to your thought processes because stuttering affects us on many different levels. And if you're working with a professional uh, who really knows what he or she is doing, they will work on all those levels. So, that is really important. Uh, you know, there are a couple of different skills. Some things, some tasks you can learn easily. For example, to speak in front of the camera. How long do you think it takes to uh, more or less feel comfortable doing this? I mean, for me, it took me like four days. I think I practiced four days in a row and then I caught this moment. I, I was like, yeah, I'm feeling it. I can do this. So from that day, I was able uh, to do it to the best of my abilities. I'm not saying that I'm the best, you know, um, speaker, that I'm the best presenter, but it didn't take a long time to learn this. If you want to learn swimming, my mom learned to uh, learn how to swim when she was 50 years old. I mean, in just one week, I think she learned that. She's not the best swimmer, but she did. How long did it take you to learn how to ride a bike? I bet a couple of hours. So certain skills that are simple skills, you know, relatively simple. It takes a uh, short time to learn them. Speaking is not one of them. I mean, learning a different language. I mean, you guys who speak a different language. I mean, how long did it take you to learn a different language? I mean, for me to learn uh, the English language, I think it took me three plus years um, and I was living in a different country. So uh, I remember the time when I felt that, yeah, I, I like the way I sound, I like the way I talk. I'm not confusing my words and I do confuse my words because I'm not a native speaker, but I mean, speaking is one of the skills that takes time to learn. So you have to keep that in mind. Um, and if you want to get rid of your stuttering, three days will not be enough. You have to find the professional that will be your guide for a period that is longer than that. I would say a couple of months or maybe a couple of years, but I think it's totally worth it because Speaking, as I was saying in my other video, it's one of the best um, things, one of the best creations, one of the best abilities that we as human beings have. And you should utilize this specific skill to make your life better. And as I was saying, to share ideas and thoughts and to create, to communicate, to inspire. Speaking is amazing. I mean, you should get it under control. That's what I think. Also, I think that... Um, if you start the course and something goes wrong, something doesn't work out, you're, uh, you're not very happy, I mean, realize the road will be bumpy. 
you will fall down and you will have to pick yourself up a couple of times. I mean, don't believe all those courses that tell you just in three simple steps and 10 simple steps, you will get somewhere and the result will be 100% guaranteed. That will not happen. You should look at this realistically. So look at it realistically and uh, find the course, find the person that you like. Uh, when you're finding a coach, uh, somebody that you will be sharing your intimate you know, feelings with, you have to find somebody. I don't think that person, you should base your findings on his or her qualifications. I mean, that is very important, yes. But you should focus on, do you like that person? How, how is she or he making you feeling? Are you feeling comfortable? Do you trust that person? I mean, is he or she real? Is that the real deal? So that's what I think you should uh, focus on. So what exactly would I do if I wanted to get this area of my life under control? What if I wanted to speak more and stutter less? Where would I go? Who would I talk to? Who, who would I trust? Where would I invest my money and time in? Well, a couple of years ago, I was making a video about stuttering. The video was really long. It was in Russian. It got a lot of comments, a lot of likes. A lot of people were asking me what to do. A few people called me. And during that period, um, I saw another guy on YouTube. He, wa he was making and is making videos on stuttering and what to do with it. And unlike me, he does it professionally. So his name is Alexander Degilevich and he operates out of Russia, Moscow. And uh, you can check out his website down below. There is a phone number that you can call. There is uh, all kinds of information in English. He talks about his approach and his method. Uh, he has, um, you know, his sessions are in different format. So, you know, for like one session, as far as I can see, you would pay 200 bucks, you know, and it lasts like two hours. You talk on Skype. Uh, for four sessions and they last over uh, more than five days, you would pay $1,000 and for 10 sessions, you would pay uh, $2,000. So those prices compared to, to, you know, the average on the market is more than reasonable, in my opinion. And uh, I've known Alex for, you know, more than two, two years. And what I really have to say is that what I like is that uh, he really treats every single uh, person that he works with as an individual. You know, a lot of coach coaches will, will tell you that our program is individual, it's tailored to your needs, but when it comes to, to the actual program, it's not like that. You get some generic, you know, stuff that you can apply to almost everybody. In his approach and what I saw in his videos, and I had a chance to speak to a few of his clients who are very happy with, you know, how they were to speak before and after, I mean, I think that he, he really does it, you know, he's the real deal and uh, he sees you as an individual and he works with those issues and those things that you go through. Uh, once your sessions are over, you can, you can call him, you can talk to him, you know, you can, uh, so he actually supports you afterwards. So this is what I, what I want to say, if you want to uh, work with your stuttering, if you want to get some help. I mean, obviously, dude, I mean, you can do this by yourself, right? But if you get a professional, if you get somebody who is doing it for a living, who's been doing it for a long time, you will get your results much, much faster and you will be able to speak normally, you know, and to, uh, I think, like, I, like I've said before, I think it's so important to get this aspect of your life under control. It's one of the most important aspects and uh, you will do so much better in all the other areas of your life. So once again, thank you for listening.